Conservative leader Andrew Scheer's climate plan would focus on a technology investment-based, not tax-based system to encourage polluters to cut down on emissions with the intention of reaching the Paris climate targets. Scheer's committed to abandoning the Liberals' carbon tax. Instead, the plan would force companies that produce more than 40 kilotons of emissions per year to invest in green technologies at an amount set by the government. Penalty costs would increase the more a facility pollutes. Funds from emitters would then be reinvested back into the private sector in fields of research, development and emissions-reducing technologies. A green patent credit will also be introduced, cutting corporate tax rates from 15% to 5% for any company developing and patenting green technologies in this country. Shear's climate plan also includes promoting a Canadian clean brand, reliable sources of energy to encourage larger global emitters such as China to reduce the usage of coal. The plan includes $500 million over three years to accelerate capital cost allowances to industries in this country that can prove they are reducing emissions in other countries or can show they are world leaders in low carbon intensity. The plan will also bring back a two-year version of the former Conservative government's home retrofit program. Under Shear's plan, homeowners could receive a refundable tax credit of as much as $2,850 on renovations totaling $20,000. Conservatives estimate the two-year program would cost the federal government $900 million per year.